Hi guys, thanks for tuning in to the FreedomGear.org channel. At FreedomGear.org, we sell the highest quality solvent trap kits, adapters, and muzzle devices on the market, as well as other survival supplies. If you have not checked us out in a while, we highly encourage you to do so, as we are adding new product offerings all the time. Today, I'm going to be reviewing our latest products, which are now available with custom Cerakote finishes. If you're not familiar with Cerakote, let me explain what it is. Cerakote is a type of ceramic coating that is often used to provide a durable and protective finish for arms, knives, and other metal objects. It's a thin film coating that is applied by spraying, dipping, or brushing onto the surface of the object, and then it is cured through a heat treatment process. Since launching the Cerakote series solvent trap kits, we've had some customers ask us if they can send us their arms and see if we can match the schema. And the answer to that is no, we're not a full customization shop. However, if you have a photo of something that you currently have and you would like us to just see if we can match it, we can take a look and see what we can do. You can send that photo to info at freedomgear.org. Another question that we received is what is the product durability like after completing the Cerakote finish? And the answer to that will be given in a follow-on video where we do a scratch test side by side. All right, so let's move into the actual video now of the process of making a Cerakote solvent trap kit. As you can see here in our sandblast hood, we have some of the parts that we sell as part of the kit that are going through the process of cleaning. In this process, we have to remove all dirt, oil, and any other grime that might be in the product. A fun fact about doing Cerakote is that when you're cleaning the tubes, as you can see the titanium is shown here, is throwing quite a few sparks. With the aluminum tubes, as shown here, as you can see there is no sparks being emitted, very few. Once we've completed the process of sanding off all of the existing color and dust, dirt, and oils from the tubes, the next stage in the process is to do a quick dry cleaning, which is to just dust off all of the existing sand, dirt, and grime that was left in the sandblasting process. When that is done, we move on to the next step, which is to scrub the tubes with a cleaning solvent to then remove away any ad additional sand, oils, and dirt that might be left in the process. After that, the process is very simple. The tubes have to be extremely clean and dry in order for the Cerakote to adhere to the tubes in the metal. In this process, we're going to make sure that we have a very dry, very clean tube, and everything at this point has to be done with gloves on to prevent oil transfer to the metal. After the tube is completely dried and is now ready for paint, we're going to go ahead and prepare the Cerakote process. For this, we're going to use our basic airbrush gun, which you can get at pretty much any Amazon or uh, any online retailer that sells that type of stuff. Cerakote is very unfriendly to these guns though, so a thorough cleaning after every use is highly needed. Once the base paint color has been applied to the solvent trap tubes for any of our camo or multicolor tube schemes, we will then put the tubes and all the adapters and parts into the oven for a quick 20 minute bake. Doing this allows us to then handle the tubes and complete the process with greater ease in the following steps. And as we wrap up the process of completing this solvent trap, I just wanted to say we have plenty of options on our website if you would like to check them out. Or if you see something that you would like to see and we don't have it, please reach out to us. We'd be more than happy to talk to you about. Thank you for watching the video. Just wanted to conclude by showing you some photos of the available Cerakote options. If you would like to see more, please visit us at freedomgear.org and 
click on any of the products that you are interested in. There is an option there that you can choose and add to the cart should you decide to buy one. Thank you again and look forward to seeing you at freedomgear.org.